Bagamat wala na sa spotlight ang mga dating Filipino Alskals na si Team Captain Chiti Kaligdong, patuloy niyang pinopromote ang sport ng football sa Pilipinas sa pamamagitan ng mga football clinics. Ngayong Sabado, gagalipin ang last leg ng Football for a Better Life 2015 sa Army Support Command Football Field sa Tagig. Kasama natin ngayong gabi si Captain Chiti Kaligdong at ang kapwa niyang former Alskal si Ref Coresma. Narito rin si Albert Alimendralejo, ang organizer ng Football for a Better Life Aside from the football clinic, pag-uusapan natin ang TV special na Pangarap Kong World Cup Part 2 na ipapalabas dito sa ABS-CBN Sports in Action ngayong November 17. Ref, Albert, Chiefy, welcome back to The Score. Yeah, welcome. Thanks for joining good us. Good evening, good evening. Okay, Chiefy, simulan natin sa'yo. Alala ko, pinag-usapan natin ito noong nagsimula yung programa na kakaiba tong clinic na to. Anong naiba? You've done clinics before, you've done camps before. Paano naiba yung Football for Life this year para sa'yo? Um... Basically, sir, no, uh, football for a better life, mm. uh, support uh, the football para sa bayan, okay. the globe football para sa bayan. Mm. So, um, we have a partnership with the uh, Pro-Life UK right. Football for a Better Life mm -hmm. sa, sa globe tele, uh, mm. as a globe uh, sports ambassador. Mm. So, uh, nandito ako no, to, to, para tumulong sa kanila. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, the same advocacy, no, the same advocacy and uh, different concept, no, mm. and uh, dito sa... Uh, uh, Globe Football para sa Bayan and Pro Life UK Football mm -hmm. a Better Life um, giving chance yung mga bata no, na no. magkaroon ng uh, mabigyan ma natin ng mga scholarship Once a time, ganun ka. Yes. Bata yeah. ka na dumaan sa football clinic na yes. inspired. Oh, okay. Pero ito na iba kasi maraming ang camps out there but yours gives scholarships in yes. the end no, no. to the deserving so, no, ones. I, we have now uh, in, in this program mm. no, since uh, last year mm. pa uh, uh, two years ago, no, okay. uh, meron kami nga uh, uh, six uh, players uh, right. ngayon na sa Dila Salzobel. Wow. So from the and province, yes. sa Metro Manila. At the same time, doon okay. din sa sa Globe, no, meron mm. din na uh, meron din silang uh, I think three or four mm. na pinasok din sa na scholarship right. maliban doon sa Subel right. and uh, at the same time dito sa Pro Life UK, maraming like sa San Beda. Mm -hmm. So we're giving them a good, uh, not only playing football, but a good future Education. sa sa kanila na yung Correct. academic and sport, ka, paano yun nila i-balance. So yun yung, uh, um, uh, yung program, yun yung objective yeah. ng, ng program, yung impact nila na, mm -hmm. uh, kumbaga, uh, yung mga private school and public school, how to interact with, uh, sa, sa pag, yun. yeah. Uh -huh. Graf, yun yung, ano. you were part of the camp in Dumaguete. Kamo yeah. sa experience mo, teaching these kids, helping them out, and bibira din that they can learn from a goalie. Okay, it's hard, it's very few, uh, when I was growing up, I didn't have goalkeepers I was looking up to when I tried goalkeeping. Pero, kamo sa experience mo? Well, uh, it was not just an experience because it was, uh, it was something, a life-changing uh, thing because mm -hmm. I came, I come from Dumaguete. Right. And uh, it's good to be part of this advocacy with mm -hmm. Chief and Sir Albert and Pro uh, Pro Life UK because uh, in Dumaguete, I know the some uh, I know some of the kids. Okay. Um, I'm reaching out to them and then um, may iba may iba talaga siya kasi um, those kids parang it's those kids are part of you. Eh. Mm -hmm. You come from that place, and then um, with with the help of Chief and and Sir Albert. Na bigyan din siya ng opportunity mm -hmm. to anong difference i mean i'm sure there are football schools there are football teams there but you brought a british style professional training then yeah. diba kamo sa yung impact niyon sa kanila and how is that going to help them uplift yung quality ng football nila sa Dumaguete well uh, the good thing about provincial kids um, they 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 love to be inspired okay uh, nice. Correct. and then with chief and Sir, uh, christian mm -hmm. was coaching them malaki yung um, Malaki yung tingin nila that mm -hmm. there's an opportunity mm -hmm. that not only football but through football also we can achieve education. Well, Albert, you're you know of course central to this whole program, so kudos to you for helping out these kids <laughs> first of all. Uh, and it you know it's it's not easy to get sponsors sometimes for these kinds of programs. Tell us yeah. how how the support from the British ambassador to everybody else and and long term vision you know hindi ito pang oh, sandalian lang. Uh, this is a six-year program wow, that okay. started in 2013. Yes. When the British Council, the British government sent mm. 22 kids to train in the UK. Yep. Mm -hmm. Thereafter, we said, well, private sector has to come in no, mm -hmm. and continue with the program. So that is where Pool Life came in. Mm -hmm. And they said we wanted to expand and look for other kids okay. that might be part of the program. Okay. So we went to 10 areas all over the Philippines with Chiefy here, mm -hmm. Ref joining us and all that. And we started to discover other kids 
that might be part of the little ascals. Right, right. Then aside from the scholarship of Chiefy, this might be the future of uh, Philippine football right. mm -hmm. because the the World Cup happens every four years, yep. and we have to start really early, no, mm -hmm. not uh, a few years before that. But rather, in this case, we're starting six years in 2011. They will be 17 years old in 2019, and That's hopefully right. for the U17, this will be the team. So, of course, some kids come and go. Mm -hmm. We're not telling you, oh, you'll be the one for 2019, but we're still looking for the best as Correct. we go along. Correct. Chiefy, uh, para sa yon, nakita mo ni mga batang to, gano ka laking tulong sa kanila na nagsasama sila magagaling? Kasi, syempre, bawa, magaling ka, lumaki ka sa, sa negros, no? Pero hindi lahat ng kasama mo, gano'ng kagaling. Kasi iba yung level of play, when you play with kids better than you and as good as you, ano yung difference nun na when they're put together in one program na long term? Um, maganda yung, ano, yung, uh, yung result mm. is maganda. Kasi uh, talking about um, quality, di ba? Mm, so yun yung, uh, yun yung importante kasi uh, uh, yung, yung program naman to is uh, uh, like dito sa pangarap kong World Cup no, mm. na 20... 2019. So, dito uh, sinasanay na yung mga bata. No? Hindi natin pwedeng, kaya may, uh, may nag-identify tayo ng talents. Right. Mm -hmm. no? Ng potential kung sino yung pwede natin i mm -hmm. ilagay doon sa sa, kumbaga pinipili natin, hinahasa natin. So, right. giving a chance na mag, uh, magkaroon, nag, may chance sila na magkaroon mm -hmm. makasali sa national team. Correct. So, dito pa lang sa, sa program na to, um, a good chance no mm -hmm. nakikita natin habang mas bata sila na mag, mag, mag bigyan natin sila ng uh, uh, tamang training mm -hmm. uh, bigyan ng magandang uh, uh, chance mm -hmm. doon sa sa training na to so it's a very good ano uh, very good uh, good start no right. para sa kanila at Ref, sa, yeah. din, no? you worked your way into the national team yeah. kamo say opportunity for these kids na now they see the the path to get there kasi mm -hmm. siguro na bata ka it was not that easy, probably, yeah. na makapasok sa national team. Pero, nung nakita may mga bata, alam nila meron ng may magandang programa, may pa tamang paraan, uh, gano'ng kalaking impact kaya sa kanila yun, to go for their dreams all the more? Uh, once, uh, given an opportunity to touch uh, these kids' lives mm -hmm. in teaching, sometimes kasi ma ma makwento mo sa kanila that we started at your pace, right. with your age, Correct. and then we keep playing, we balance education and mm -hmm. playing at the same time. Mm -hmm. This is the difference um, of just being a regular athlete then at the same time in education mm -hmm. do we tell them all the time that there is an opportunity may may paraan Correct. may may oportunidad na darating at darating at ma, ma reach nyo whatever goal you have to do in the pitch in school keep learning keep doing everything if mangarap ka lang taasan nyo na that's right well these two guys <laughs> matagal ko nang kilala to very inspiring they're not just great football players very inspiring albert before we go november 17 november 17 two? yeah pangarap kong world cup it's the Second of the series, yep. it's airing here. Sports and action, airing in balls. Eventually, Sunday's best on prime time. All right, so yeah. a lot of places for you to catch it. Don't That's miss right. it. Uh, Ref, Albert, Chiefy, thank you for joining us. Thank you for the great work. And sana marami pa tayo inspire na kabataan. Maraming salamat. Yes, salamat. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.